good morning everybody this is the first course we are starting for quality management in clinical or medical laboratory so first of all let me introduce myself i am dr jayesh varade i am working as a senior manager quality in minakshi mission hospital and research center madurai so this course will be divided into subsequent parts or subsequent lectures which will tell you about the details in quality management in medical laboratory so to the starts we will see what's the content of the course in the course we are going to see iso 1509 which is the international standard for medical laboratories its comparison with alternative or supplementary framework that is clsi guideline qms 01 a4 the difference between accreditation process and certifications various approaches to quality management the philosophy and principles of quality management will be described pathways laboratories are using to implement quality management systems will be described so this is the various content of this course now what is quality management it's an organization wide framework to coordinate management activities to ensure that organization meets of its customers or users quality management systems quality management systems involve from quality control external quality assessment process testings and it play important role in overall quality management systems now what is quality so according to iso 9002 the quality is defined as the degree to which a set of inherent characteristics fulfills requirements or the iso defines that need or an expectations that is stated generally implied or obligatory and a characteristics as a distinguishing features so quality is described by iso in two two ways in 9002 it says that the degree to which a set of inherent characteristics are fulfilled according to the requirements and iso defines a requirement as a need or expectation that is stated generally implied or obligatory in nature and the characteristics as a distinguishing features so what is quality management quality management has its origin in statistical process control of analytical variations equa that is external quality assessment or proficiency program highlighted great variability in laboratory performance there has been a progressive improvement in equa or external quality assessment and for proficiency testing performance over time quality management has its origin in the statistical process there has been a progressive improvement to imp in improvement of the equa or pt performance over time corresponding to both advances in analytical techniques and to the introduction of qms within laboratories although some laboratories see the role as the delivery of analytical correct result itself this is i will consider it is as a very narrow view and one that overlooks the reality that an analytical correct results may still be of poor quality because of not meeting for example turnaround time cost delivery methods or any of a host of user specific criteria a quality laboratory services a quality laboratory service is one that knows the users criteria and needs all at times and has an internal system that can ensure those are met when users criteria change a quality laboratory will have procedure to detect these changes and even if unannounced it will adapt itself to respond appropriately now quality management systems there is a other aspect which mentions that meeting the accreditation standards to have the organization sophistication to be able to achieve these degrees of response make may take time although some laboratories see meeting accreditation standard as an aim itself such laboratories will lose the benefit of the culture of organization wide customer focus and systematic continuous improvement that comes from the use of qms to drive overall quality rather than being a merely a tool for achieving minimal acceptable standards so topics covered in this course will be quality management systems including internationally applicable standards 
and guidelines and the key component of such systems accreditation and regulation of medical laboratories including international model that it includes self assessment through accreditation and regulation approach to quality management including an understanding of its basic principle add on topics which we will cover in this course will be organizational quality and basic excellence framework or business excellence framework majors and quality indicators so thank you all the best we can start with the course from the next lectures hope you will find it interesting and expecting your valuable feedback thank you